right, guys. <laughs> what an intro. Okay, Video Game Jay and Poop here with another playthrough. This time, we are going through Kirby 64, The Crystal Shards. Uh, the only Kirby game on the Nintendo 64. So, yeah, pretty much the first Kirby game ever. The first 3D one. So, yeah. Uh, again, I'm on the Nintendo Wii for this. Uh, not Virtual Console. But through the dream collection and why does the n64 logo have to come up every time i press the home button that is so weird it does that on some games on virtual console and all not all of them but still and i'm guessing it happens to this game on virtual console as well which clearly happens here but still um and again just like uh, dreamland 3 uh, it creates a save file whenever you um press it so like this there you go. <laughs> it's just like that. Uh, that's why I like it like this. So, um, so this game, it's kind of a sequel to Dreamland 3, but not too much. And I say kind of a sequel because it's it has like some enemies from Dreamland 3 and such. So, uh, first off, we'll uh, go through the settings and see what we have. Obviously, we want that. You can choose your display. Uh, with the fourth one being different in the Japanese version as well. But I'll just go with the first one, so. And let's start the game. Do you want to know how to use Kirby's copy abilities? No, because most of you probably know, but if you don't, then yeah, you want to. I said no! <laughs> one of you in the instructions? Oh, it's the instructions. No thanks. You get this wonderful cutscene of Kirby. And someone fell on her. Oh, I mean him. <laughs> I keep forgetting what gender Kirby is. We meet this new character named Ribbon. That take two crystal shards together to make a big one. Surprised how smooth the emulation is on the Wii for N64 emulation. Because N64 emulation is really bad sometimes. Anyways, here, level 1, Popstar. Again, it's where Kirby lives. Uh, now... Uh, so, then we have our first level. Uh, it goes like this in this game. Uh, where you, where you select it like this and then... Boom. Now! For the controls, now on N64, the con you can only use the D-pad to control, but thanks to Virtual Console and that, you can also use the D-pad. Which means we could do a cool glitch, but I'm not really going to do it yet, I'm just going to mainly use the D-pad most of the time. Uh, and of course A and B buttons are for jumping, inhaling and spitting, of course. Uh, new to this game is that you can actually combine abilities together. So here we have the cutter and needle, I think, uh, to make this. Yeah, you can have combined uh, abilities, and to get rid of it, you just press the L or R buttons. No, Z or R buttons, because it's N64. Oh wait, no, it is L and R buttons, because the Z button's where the analog stick is. Right here, what we just collected is a crystal shard. Uh, you need all of them in the game if you want 100% and fight the true final boss. And here, in the house, we find a mini boss. It's very easy, just spit him. Yeah, he just takes a few hits, there we go. Uh, this time I am using a normal Wii Classic controller instead. So, rather than the SNES controller, I could have used that, but it would have been weird for this game because it's on the N64. Uh, and plus, I prefer to use the analog stick most of N most N64 games, but this is one of those games where you have to use the D-pad, regardless of, regardless of what version you play. Uh, oh, I think we need something for that. Um, we need, like, an explosion, I think. Yeah, some of these crystal shards are really hidden. In fact, can we get it with the bomb? Oh, we can, yeah. It's our second one. 
And you can pause the game too. Well, pause the game. You can try again as well. Yeah. We go here. And the waddle dee! Finds a crystal shot. And then glitches behind him. Oh, nope. It's a black eyeball. I think you'll recognize what it is. If you play Dreamland 3, 100%. Oh, it's going into the Waddle Dee. Oh, it's a Waddle Do now! Okay. So we just gotta fight it. And it grabbed me. Okay. Alright, we're just gonna get closer. Oh, he's got something on his head. That's weird. Alright, we're just gonna. Oh, it got rid of the start. Oh, he's crying. <laughs> Alright. I'm just gonna... Oh, whoa! Okay. And then he goes back like that, and we get our third and final crystal shard. And whoa, weird glitches happening with the capture card there. Whoa! Hold on, guys. Alright, my apologies. My capture card was being weird for some reason. I have no idea why it was doing that. Let's hope it doesn't do it again. But as we can see, Waddle Dee has joined our team. And then here, you get to choose what you want, so... So, oh. Most of the time, you want to try and get a card in these, because they... They're not, not required to 100% the game, but it, they are kind of useful to have for your collection in this game, so... So we've got everything in there. But let's show off that uh, glitch you can do, only on the Virtual Console version. So let's say you hold left on the D-pad and then right on the analog stick, then... You can do this! <laughs> We can moonwalk! <laughs> Yay! We can moonwalk! Hold on. Yeah, we're moonwalking! <laughs> we can moon- And do that. Okay. Hold on. There we go! We're moonwalking! There we go! <laughs> and get stuck in place. Okay. And we're gonna die. Ah, why not? Alright, there we go. Now to the second level. It's gonna- Yep, it saves your health. <laughs> Alright, um... Alright. Not that it matters too much, and... Okay. Uh, now, when you're in the air inhaling, there is a limit in this game. Uh, of how long you can be in the air. Another cool thing is that you can move while inhaling as well, just like that. Uh, and it's only possible in this game, I think, anyway. I don't know if there were any other Kirby games that did that... We died. Yeah, that's what the dying animation is like in this game. It's not like Kirby falling down like Mario. <laughs> or Sonic, but just dying. <laughs> Whoa! Kirby was like looking at the air and inhaling. Wow, that was so funny. Alright, come on. Whoa, whoa! Okay. Alright, tomato up there. And then we're gonna... Get that enemy there. And a, and a mole-like enemy. Yeah, I need to try and get used to the controls on Virtual Console, because I'm used to N64 controls. And then here we have a sandwich. Now, in the Japanese version, it is not a sandwich. It is instead a rice ball. So yeah, every food in this game has been changed to western-like food in non-Japanese versions. Kind of like Kirby Superstar. And how that game in the game's gourmet race. Well, most, mostly the gourmet race. But other game modes as well, where the food was different across all versions. Same with this game. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, oh, we have stars up here. The stars, again, just like Dreamland 3 and 2, uh, getting all of them across your meter will uh, give you an extra life. Uh, so... Oh, hey, Waddle Dee! Right, here. It's a cable car. Now, there is a crystal shard here, which is very difficult to get. 
uh, only because it's at the bottom. It may sound easy, but because of the limitations of Kirby inhaling, where it'll stop for a while, then it's it makes it harder, so. Alright, it's right here. Then you've got to quickly get up. There you go. There's no time to get that. I actually got that on first try. Alright. <laughs> Alright. You just go up there. Alright, there we go. And... Oh, there was a one up there! Oh, and I had the enemy in me still, so I could have spat it at this... This... Uh, Gurliam enemy. Uh... I'm just gonna... Spit again. And notice how the boss counter is literally at, uh... The same as the star counter. Yeah, it just overwrites it. The one... I think in a beta version of this game, there was gonna be a boss counter as well. Oh, we got another cutscene. Got a painter that looks like Addo from Dreamland 3. And another Dark Matter got him, or her, I don't know what gender. Right, so we have a similar boss to Addo in uh, Dreamland 3, but this time, this one in 64, it's called Adeline. I don't know if it's the same character or if it's a different character, but they do look similar and they do similar things. But still, I, I just, I'm just going to class them as the uh, same character. I don't know if they actually are, but maybe you guys can let me know in the comments. But still, and something pixelated, is it? something inappropriate or something? Ah, whatever, we'll eat it. We're gonna... <laughs> so we have the Ice Dragon again. So, yeah, we'll fight the Ice Dragon again. It's still 16-bit graphic style and not 3D model, I'm surprised. Yeah, we killed it. <laughs> and then, the Dark Matter... This is not usually paint by Addo in the original. And Dark Matter is like the final boss of Dreamland 3. And he doesn't attack like that. And he doesn't face forward all the time. He looks left and right as well. That is so weird. Still wish he was my bit. <laughs> no, 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 okay. Um, alright. Come on. Bring your poop. Poop. There we go. Come on, poop again. There we go. You just pooped, and then boom. And then here, you're gonna do a similar thing. Hold down, and then A, and then you kick him. There we go. Or you kick it. I don't know what gender it is. I'm just gonna say it's a boy, because it looks like a boy. Then Adeline's joining us. On the adventure. <laughs> Look at all these eyes. It's like, yeah, you come with us. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's try and get the card again. Oh, no, I missed it. <laughs> Look at Kirby. He's crying. <laughs> it's so hard to get them, but... Like, I know they're not required to 100% the game, but it's still neat to have them. Oh, now we're in, like, a castle-like area. Oh, and the rocket just gives you a bomb. <laughs> How useful is that? No, it's not. All right. Oh, I think there was, like, a secret at the start of the level, I believe. If you go all the way at the back, you find a star. That is it. Pointless, but still. But it's still neat to have. And we got hit by the fire. Okay. Oh, whoa. And sometimes you can even combine two of the same abilities. So we got a massive cut and Kirby's body just cut off and then came back. All right. Wow. Okay. Kirby looks like a big bean. Wow. It's a walking bean. All right. Get in the castle then. And 
And you would think if it's 3D, you would think it's like an open world adventure, like the newly uh, Forgotten Worlds, but... No, Forgotten Land. Uh, it could be in the Forgotten Land, but nope. It's just still 2D controls, <laughs> so it's not open world 3D. Like, this is 3D, but it's 2D gameplay. So, yeah. Unfortunately, you're not gonna get, like, Kirby move around anywhere. Uh, right. I believe one of these areas has a crystal shard somewhere. Obviously, every level has three crystal shards, I think. I think it's three each. This way, there's a crystal shard. Oh, no, it's a tomato, I mean. <sighs> Whatever, I thought it was... What happens if we go back down? <gasps> we can go back! Wow. That is so funny. Um, we'll just um, go on top of the door. Alright. Oh, I wanted to hurt him. And I, I instead got hurt by it. So, uh, before we go down there, I believe there's a crystal shard this way. No, a sandwich. Or rice ball in the Japanese version. Uh, I think we go down here. Oh, it's down here. Oh! You just use that to destroy it, and then you get it. Wow. Oh, hey, Adeline. Oh, one up. Yeah. So, what he'll grab you? What? It depends on your stats. So, if you're not if you're not full health, it'll he'll give you a tomato. Uh, if you are full health, he'll give you a one up. Maybe maybe something else. I don't know. Right on top here, there's a crystal shard. You definitely want it. So, and then we can climb up. You must get that first if you haven't got it before. Before heading on. So, yeah. Uh, avoid that. There we go. Alright. And kill you. There we go. Run, Kirby, run. And then climb up here. Uh, it doesn't matter which way you go. We need to go to that spotlight. Whoa, avoid the fire. Yeah, you'd have to do that. Alright. Get out of my way, get out of my way, get out of my way. Alright. There we go. Up here, and then... Another cutscene. King DDD! And he finds a crystal shard. Uh-uh. You're not having it, Kirby. No, 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 no. It's mine. <laughs> and then the dark matter comes in. And... Again, possesses DDD. Just like Dreamland 3. And 2, I guess, but... But it's more like Dreamland 3 here. Yeah, so, fight with DDD is easy in this game. We almost killed him already. There we go. And yeah, he's going for his flying Dreamland 3 form. But, you just use the cutter thing. Boom. Oh, we got him! Wow! And touching him does that for some reason. <laughs> it looks like we've been pooped out of him. Right. Oh, my Wii remote. Right. <laughs> DD don't want to join. <laughs> but he does it anyway. <laughs> Wow, there's one up there, but then there's a card there. I'll try and get the card. Yes, we got it! Yes, our first card. Uh, what those cards do, they basically have information on what enemies are like. So not just bosses, but also regular enemies. Uh, so uh, now we've got a boss fight. So we got every crystal shot here. Every boss fight only has one crystal shot, and that's after beating them. So... So clearly, you all know what this one is. Wispy goddamn woods, yes. Of course. Who would have known? Because almost every first boss in a Kirby game is most likely going to be Wispy Woods. Or every Kirby game is likely going to have Wispy Woods in. Because <laughs> he's a famous tree. Um, Alright, there we go. There we go, we destroyed that. And you just eat his apples, and then you destroy his root things. Alright, there we go. Ah, oh, 
put them in. Then, after this, he gets angry like this. And then you have to destroy these root things, and then it damages him. Yeah, it's what you gotta do. The 3D gimmick is cool here, and then he'll drop a bunch of apples. Um, I wanna... You wanna try and at least get, like, more than one apple in your mouth. So, to, like, damage him more, so you can damage more of his roots and then deal, deal more damage. Oh, I didn't... Are you serious? Alright, here we go. Oh, wrong button. It don't matter. Alright. Hit him there. There we go. Bring your apples, there we go. Don't like apples, but still. Come on, get the ri Oh, it didn't even hit it. Oh, come on. Come on, bring your apples out, there we go. Oh, we've got two this time, there. Right, here we go. One, two. All right, oh, it's glitching out again. Hold on, guys. Alright, my apologies, I had to sort my capture card out again, it's glitching for some reason. No idea why. Anyways, back here. Whoa, I've had two again. Uh, we're likely gonna kill him now. Boom, he's dead! And then grab the crystal shard. to another planet. This time the next planet, Rockstar. Uh, no, not the game company that makes some games, but also, but the planet's Rockstar. Uh, now this time, levels start to have an extra level in them, so, so you'll have four main levels and then a boss level. So only the first and then final world has uh, three main levels and then one boss. So, yeah. Just so you be warned. This is like a desert-themed planet. Alright, oh, we've got these. There we go. Oh, boy. I just burped. And then... Okay. Alright. We have a rock here that we don't need. Oh, whoa! How about we get a double rock and then we're a massive Kirby. All right. Wow, right, we'll just go through. Okay. Come on. Yeah, and in fun fact, in like beta versions of this game, you could also jump with the rock abilities, no matter uh, both big and small. But not in the final game, unfortunately. It's weird. Like I wish you could in the final, but so here you have another crystal shard. Uh, now, obviously, if I miss them, I will come back for them because there is a counter of how many you've got. So luckily, uh, here you find some ice cream. I think that was. Alright, go up here, then, we have a boss, it's, oh, it's a green star, alright, we're just gonna, yeah, just keep bullying it, there we go, and then, then just get oh, another crystal shard, and then let's get out, oh, in this room, you wanna be, you wanna be very quick here, yeah, you wanna be very quick here, alright, so here, you see sand rising up, and then a face, uh, making it quicker. So there is a crystal shard here, and it's very easy to miss. Well, not easy to miss to see it, but but it's easy to like almost miss it entirely. So, like obviously you can always come back, but I mean, 
I mean, doing it on my first try is easy, easy, easy to miss. Let's see if I can get it, though. I don't know where it is in this room, though. Oh, I don't think it is in this room. Oh, maybe maybe I'm talking about something else that is similar. And then here. Waddle Dee! Up there, and then... Get up here. And you cannot go back down because of the sand. I believe there is a crystal shard there, though. But, but what you need is interesting. You have Scarfies around here. Like, I don't know what you need, but I have to see. Oh yeah, it was like... It was like a, a strong spike. A not strong spike, a strong spark ability. That you needed. Alright, we'll go for here. We'll just finish it, and then... Alright, there's a card there. Can I get it? Yes! There we go. Uh, it's like a spike... No, not a spike, a spark ball we need. But what do you... But I forgot what you combine it with. Um... Because I know you combine it with an, with an ability. Uh, I know it's not... Ne oh, I think it's the rock. That's it. It's the rock ability. That's it. Um... Right, I know what to do then. And then that's how you get it. You can also try and get another uh, enemy card in this stage at the end as well. And we got an extra life. Yay! And don't jump to the enemy. Right, here we go. Uh, we don't want to kill it. We just want to... There we go. I think that's it. Yes, this ability we need. So, so stone and spark. So, this is very broken almost as well. It kills when it... It can go near enemies and kill them. And it rarely comes back to you. So, as you can see here, wow. And when it touches you then it, or breaks, then you'll have to activate it again. Now, what do crystal shards look like when you've collected them? Just a blue star and it gives you, I think, 5 points? Or 10 points? It seemed like... It's not like it's kind of like blue coins in uh, Mario 64, uh, where they give you five normal coins, but but for Kirby it's like more stars. Right here we go. Come on! No, don't touch me. There we go. Oh, I want to get that. I couldn't count that, but still. Right here we go. This room. Wow, it was like flying. And see if you can manage to get it stuck in, like, in there. See if you can get it stuck in there. There we go! Oh, almost got stuck, but not exactly. It got stuck! It stuck! Oh, and it went through. <laughs> yeah, you can do funny glitches, but still. No time for glitches. We gotta continue our journey, finding the crystal shards. And I think for these videos, I'll make it for like I'll make them like 50 to one hours long, so I can beat more levels in more worlds in like one video. So, hey, one or ding again. Uh, what was that way again? Nothing. But down here, definitely was. Yes, the last crystal shard here. There we go. Let's see if we can continue this over and over again. Or not. Alright. Here we go. Oh, come on. I want to try and... There we go. It's working. It's working. Oh, oh that enemy. Was that like a skull wrap? Like, not these enemies that are behind us. Oh, no, 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 no. Are you kidding me? I was being bounced a lot. Oh, please tell me it still counts as getting the crystal shard. I don't know. If not, then please tell me it counts as getting it. Because I've just got it. If not, I'll get the spark ability here anyway. Because, man, I don't want to do it again. Come on, ugh! Oh, 
Because it's bone! Alright. Please tell me that counts. Alright, I'm gonna... Let's try and get that enemy card. Oh! Just about! We got that again. Does it? Yes, it does. Okay. Thank God. Alright. Even if we die. Um, God, even if we die after getting it, it doesn't matter. In fact, what was... What was Spark and Spark? Oh, yeah. It's like a... It's like this. Yeah, I'm so powerful. Oh, hell, Kirby. <laughs> All right. It doesn't matter. All right. Um, throw it out of that axe. We don't need it. Oh, and you have... You have falling pillars. I was about to say falling rocks. And they are insta-kills. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they are straight up insta-kills. And what do these things give you? Needle. They don't even look like spikes. <laughs> In fact, can we... Is he even ability? Oh, I don't know. <sighs> don't matter. I'm trying to eat him. Come on. Let's crush you. Oh. There we go. Ah, oh, I just touched him. Why? All right. There's a piggy there. Oh, I just burped. I got my extra life back. Oh, hey, sandwich. Nom, nom, nom. I don't really like sandwiches in real life, but still. Oh, what are these together? Oh. <laughs> it's just Kirby using, like, what you use for your nails or something. Or is it, like... Or is it, like... Paper. Is it, like, sandpaper he's using? I don't know. Whoa! I automatic... Okay, I just pressed the X button on my controller, and that's what it does. I never knew that. Alright, there's a crystal shard there, and you get a needle from him. Needle's kind of cool in this game, it's quite funny. Uh, if you use two needles, it's even more funny. Uh... Alright, we're just gonna... Oh, one up! Definitely want that. Yeah, enemies, like, kind of attached to you. In needle form. That's kind of funny. Uh, we're gonna go up here, and there's a sandwich in there, but I don't really need it. Um. Oh, you just stand here, and then then you get the crystal shard there. There you go. I like how ribbon appears in the animation when you get it. It's like ribbon's always with you. <laughs> yeah. Surprising because the other characters only make brief appearance in levels. And in fun fact, in like, an early development of the game, in like a beta... Oh, there's another crystal shot down here. They, uh, those characters, uh, so DDD, Adeline, and Waddle Dee, they were originally playable in this game. But they decided to scrap the idea. So, meaning you can only play as Kirby, and there's only like a few parts where you play as DDD in this game, but not too much. But in like the beta, you can play as pretty much any character that's not just Kirby. Or even DDD for a little amount of time. Uh, but we'll get to those DDD levels later on. But you still have Kirby with you. So it's not complete just DDD levels. So, but we'll get to them eventually. Oh, you don't want to stand on these for too long because they will crush you. To death! Oh. Okay, I don't know why I said it like that. But... Okay. Uh, somewhere around here is a crystal shard. I have no idea where though. You have water, of course, and waddle. Uh, no, not waddle D's, Bronto Birds. If you stand on that, it'll still crush you. Uh, I don't think there's any around here, but I believe it's beyond this way. Uh, where we find another. Alright. Do do do. Yeah. And in fact, in the beta version of this game, you would also, you could only control the game with an analog stick as well. Uh, and so the D-pad was not used back then. I kind of wish you could use both, instead of just the D-pad. Uh, because it would have been nice, because I would have preferred that, because I'm used to the analog stick. Although D-pad is obviously great for 2D games, but still... Whoa, okay. Whoa, what was that? Okay. Oh, it's this part. There we go. Now we're DDD. There we go. 
this is what I'm on about. So, uh, this is, uh, I think there is another one that you play as DDD, and it's only these short segments where you can play as him. So, his controls, where you hold B to have a strong hammer slap, uh, he would have controlled similarly to the beta if he didn't have Kirby, but because now he has Kirby, uh, it, it doesn't really mean you're just DDD, but still. We just have start here. There is a crystal shard somewhere that we can get here. So if we can find it, then that will be useful. Um, I don't know if it's up. Oh, it's there. I see it. Uh, I see it right up there. And we have to go from down. Uh, how do I get from down there? Right, I think I got it. Um, go from here. Go there. There we go. Then here. And you slam this down. As well as that enemy. And then you find it here. And I just fell off. And the enemies come back. When you've been off screen. Alright. Please jump! No! No! Come on. Thank god the enemies are not back. There we go. Uh, I think that's our last... Yeah, it's our last one in this stage. So, we just need to complete it normally. Alright, so we're just gonna... Do, 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 do. Oh wait, no, it's not that way. Dee dee dee, it's this way. Yeah, it's kind of cool playing this dee dee dee. Oh, a sandwich. I wonder what dee 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 thinks of eating sandwiches. I have no idea. Uh... I don't even know what penguins eat. Well, fish, but I wonder if he likes fish. And then this way. Oh, it's the end. Okay. Right, can I get it? Yes! Wow! I got another card. It's kind of cool seeing those animations of, like, other characters eating other food. And Waddle Dee's actually eating a rice bowl. Even, even in the English version. <laughs> it's weird. Because it's Japanese food, right? I guess you could eat it outside Japan, but I mean, it's not that common, but still. I, it's kind of strange that they, they altered the food that you collect, but not the, the food they altered, not, but not the food when the, what the characters are eating at the at like end of level completions. Oh, there's a crystal shard there in the mouth, so what you want to do is you want to stand here. Or, no, you need the stone ability. Uh, I have a lot of- Whoa! I've met them all at once. <laughs> it's like a red star. Huh? And, okay. Alright, we'll get that on the way back. But over here. Now, depending on the hole you go through, it has different results. So let's go in the left one first. Because I need to finish this again anyway. And here we have fish enemies for this fish boss. Um, wait for these to do that again. There we go. Wow! Okay. Oh, we, we land right on a crystal shard. If you went on the other side, you would have been on the other side. Um, but you will get stars on the other side. Uh, I will be doing this level again anyway because of the first thing and see if I can get another bonus card even though they're not, they're not required to 100% the game, of course. But I mean, it's still good to get them though. But you could at least try and get them, though. It's what I do. So, yeah. And thank God they're not required. Because if they are, then it would have been a hassle of doing end like end of levels dozens of times. Uh, if it was a requirement, but still. In fact, if you're on Virtual Console, or... Well, Wii U Virtual Console, or Switch. Online, which this game recently came out on. Uh, this year. Uh, you would you could just save state if you want all the bonus cards you could just save state at end of levels and then boom you can get them easily you'll have you'll obviously fail like your first time and such depending on where it is but still and one more crystal shard we need obviously the first one we need to get we need to go back and we're still in the water oh, I think it's up there I don't know I think it is. If I'm if I'm mistaken, no, it's not. <laughs> you can still inhale in the water in this game, and not spit water. And Kirby looks even better when he's fat in the water. <laughs> it just looks funnier. <laughs> All right. The capture card's doing fine at most part now. Oh, whoa! 
Yeah, because my capture card was being weird for some reason. I have no idea why. Unless it changes again, but I don't know. Alright. Up here, I think there's definitely a... Um, there's definitely a... A crystal shard. Somewhere. Oh, but there is this! That you want to avoid. We're getting these stars. Just mash the A button and then boom. You can get it there. And there's a massive one there. Just avoid it. There you go. Just get it, there you go. Obviously we've not got the first one, but but we know where it is anyway. We need the stone of LA to get it. I think we do anyway. Oh the card's easy to get. Just high jump there. There we go. We got it. Alright, um, I don't, uh, I'll wait until I get the stone ability, or, in fact, there's a few stone abilities in the first level, so let's go back there, and then we'll press try again, after getting them. Alright. What happens if we, oh, here, oh, no, I was thinking of a wrong ability. Okay. Sandwich again. We need to refill our health a bit. Uh, just wait until I get the stone ability. Or if you get two needles, then you get the funnier one, yes! But, obviously we don't need that. We need the stone ability. Try again. And then here. There you go. Then we're gonna go to the first part. And avoid these enemies. Right, I'm just gonna stay stone, so I'm not gonna take damage. There we go. Come on. There we go. Oh god. Whoa. Alright. I'm trying to avoid enemies as possible, but... No, 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 no! Oh, I'm, I'm nearly dead. Right. Right. i got to try this without taking damage. I believe you go down here. Yeah, it destroys that. There we go. Get in there. There we go, we got it. Alright, um... Alright, this time we'll go through the other hole. And I might as well cut until we get there, because it's gonna take forever to get there. Unless I die, we'll... We'll just roll down. There we go. Oh, food. I need that. Only one extra, but still. And I lost it again. Alright. Let's go the other way this time. Oh, we don't have to fight the mini boss and all. Okay. We don't have to fight these enemies and all. <laughs> it's like the things that you want to get the. It's like if you want to get useful things, you have to go through bad things. But then if you don't want the good things, then you don't have to go through anything. It's weird. Alright, uh, if I die, then I'll cut until we get it to until I get to the end thing and see if I can get a bonus card uh, but still um, but again bonus cards are not useful the, in this game they're only useful if you want like a full collection of them but they're not required 100% like I've not got all of them on my N64 copy Japanese copy but still I've got like a few of them but not all of them uh, but still, we'll go down here. Uh, so, we'll go here. Uh, and you could just revisit a level and get them again, because I think you'll always get different cards. Yeah, you'll always get different cards. Oh, we can just use stone here. Let's go down here faster. Oh, and then we still drop faster there, okay. Alright. And we still need to swim faster here. Alright, we're just gonna... There we go. Just gonna get up here. We've got an extra life. We've got eight lives. What? Oh, no, 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 no. Please, no. Okay. Um, I think it's gonna come back. Oh, I didn't get it. 
and then more stars and that thing. We don't need to get the crystal shard again. I'm not going to get it again. It's just going to be a five star thing anyway. All right, go here. Get in there. Oh, it's, the oh, it's in the same location. Wow. Okay, let's get it again. There we go. I did not need to pause the recording to get back to where we need to be. All right, fourth level. And this time, something's flashing in the background. And it's rising up. What is it? We have a bridge. That we're going across. Like, we wonder what that is. We have no idea. Do 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 wee 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 Whoa! Let's stand on this. And we're going up. <laughs> Look at Kirby sleeping, because he have low health. And some of you might, if some of you watched my videos before, you might recognize this music. Yep, yeah, from Canvas Curse, yeah, because many of Kirby Canvas Curse's music came from this game, as well as other past Kirby games. They didn't really make new music too much, apart from like, uh, like the final boss themes and the intro themes and such, but... But besides those, they're mostly from other games. Including this one. In fact, most of them are from 64. Which is funny. Come on, get through there quickly! Go down here quickly as well. Let's sit up! There we go. We're gonna wait here. And get another crystal shard! Can I get- Oh, you still die! <laughs> I wasn't fast enough. We don't need to get the thing anymore. No, we don't. So we can just get we'll get the sandwich. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Work out, Kirby. You need to exercise. <laughs> no, not really. Go up here. Jump up there. And add a line in a dark room. Now. What he's looking at is actually hints on what you need to do, but I don't know it because I don't have the spark ability, so I'm going to have to guess. And it's and it's a requirement to get to get the uh... Oh, you hold down, right. So you can't see him in the dark, but so, uh, we're going to wait until we get this spark ability, actually, but we'll finish the stage normally now. But you would hold down, and then whatever buttons were on there, you have to copy. Then you'll get a crystal shard from there. Whoa! Okay. Whoa! Okay. That was very weird. Oh, I thought that was a platform. And it's not. Whoa! You can do a long jump. <laughs> That's so funny. You can do a Kirby long jump. Oh, we got a mini boss in it. It's a crystal. Okay. With an eyeball in it. And he spat at me. Oh my god. The Spit the other way, Kirby. To the right, not the left. Alright. I said to the right, not the left. Alright. He's dead anyway. And another crystal shard. And we climb up. And climb up the pole again. And this pole is like very dangerous because you want to avoid the sparks on it. And I touched it anyway. <laughs> oh no. Whoa. Okay, I wanted the food. In fact, there's another food here I'll get. Whoa, there's two of them. And the card's just right there, okay. Just... There we go! <laughs> that is so awkward to grab, but still. Uh, and then we have another boss, but first off, I need to get the spark ability. I know where to get it. Meet you guys there. Okay, we're back. Let's see if it works. 
Oh, it doesn't. Uh, oh, we need something else to combine with spark. I don't know what it is. Okay, we got it. We need the bomb and the spark, and then... This is a code. Now, it is random on different playthroughs. So, for me, it's Christmas tree, fish, and water. Drop. So, Christmas tree, fish, wherever that is. Then, water drop. There you go. And you get it right there. Yeah, it is random what you get in different playthroughs. Uh, so, you obviously need this. I don't know if you can backlit your TV screen and see it that way, but... But then again, I don't think you can see. Uh, like, I've not tried doing that, but... But maybe it could work, we don't know. Wow, we got up there without using the purple things, wow. Huh. Whoa! Long jump! <laughs> or not. What?! How did that kill you?! I was on the side! Wow! Okay. Okay then. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I missed it. Don't kill me again. Alright, there we go. Yeah, you see the tears that are coming out when you're inhaling? That means you have, you're almost on your limit. No, don't you dare. Oh, my God. Whoa! Don't you dare. Alright, let's go up here. And boom! We're up there. And there we go. Oh, it destroys that. You can't you, you can't even inhale the green stuff that comes out of him. That's so weird. Why can't you do that? No idea. Suck him, please suck him. There we go. And then spit him out, there we go. There we go. Just gonna go up there. And we'll climb up again. And there's more food. Food. Right. Oh, and another electric thing. And another one. Whoa! He was following me. Oh, we got it though. Uh, it's right there. Oh, I got it. Wow. These are so hard to get, but still. Still worth your time getting. Now for the boss fight. Um, this boss is very interesting. So you have these, like, cube things. Alright, I forgot what they're called. I think they began with a P. I think it's, like, Pixel something? I don't know. You definitely want to dodge these things. Doo -doo -doo. Come on. Whoa, okay. And then a blue one should come up. Yep, yeah, there we go. This one's interesting. Just keep running. There you go. And now you can fight them. So after a lot of dodging, then you get to the fight in. Kirby's out of all animation. Now, you have to use the correct colours to destroy the colours. Otherwise... Oh, oh, maybe, oh no you don't. Oh, I thought you do. Unless they deal more damage when using the correct colours. Let's say we use red on red. Or it didn't do anything. Okay. Right, it did the same amount of damage there. Right, the red one's destroyed. Then, okay. Yeah, the red one doesn't do anything. Now it's just the green one that we need to get rid of. Oh, almost. Almost got him. Oh, almost there. Oh, I could have inhaled that. Dude, 
and he's defeated. They're defeated. There we go. Where's the crystal shot going? There. Right there. Alright. We get this cutscene. Okay, we suffered. Oh, he thinks they're food. Now, now he doesn't. Now he's eating an apple and a strawberry cake. <laughs> King DDD just grabs him. And we unlock a new world, of course. Aqua Star. Now I think I'll do I think I'll do this level and then I'll end the video off. So then we got the three more rena remaining levels here and then a boss. So we'll do that one first and then. Alright. So and then then it's out of the way then, so. So then I can hit the one hour mark. And I died. I think I'll make these videos one hour long instead. So yeah. So we're just whoa okay impressive just gonna keep jumping like that all right there we go here uh don't I think there's something down yet I don't know if there is uh, no, there isn't a crystal shard, it's just a tomato. Alright, we'll go here. And then. Then you have these green things from Dreamland 3. They just spit you places. So there you go. Alright, there we go, and you have these dancing things in the background. Oh, there's a crystal shard there! Almost easy to miss that one. And... Okay. Just gonna go through here. And we have a penguin! Ah, uh, you can't escape, and you get the ice ability from it. And it freezes things, of course. And you can't... Oh, from up there. Right then. You have frog enemies that come out of these. And I've destroyed my thingy ability. Eey! These frogs can eat you. So be careful. Oh, I've had two bombs. Lovely. <laughs> Alright. Oh, hold on. Okay, guys, I'm back. My apologies. I was just doing something. But we're back here, so... So yeah, we'll do this level and then we'll end the video off. Uh, that's how we'll make them like an hour long each. Almost an hour long, at least an hour long. So, since it's Kirby, we're gonna give Kirby more attention and such. So I thought, and get out of my goddamn way! Okay. All right. And we just, whoa! He keeps throwing spears at me. And then we go here. Oh, we have this needle enemy. Lovely. Easy to kill him then. Wow, okay. Get down, Kirby. Get down, get down. And thank God it does not kill you. Oh, unless we need another needle here. Let's check. Oh, hey, I had a line. Oh, it's a tomato because we don't have full health, okay. And, and yeah, the things that Kirby drops out when you have full needle is interesting as well. You have like a fork, you have a, a bee, a cactus, a pencil, 
I believe a cactus was something else in the original version. I don't know what it was. I forgot what it was, but it was something different. Alright, to get that... To get that, um... Crystal shard, you need to do something here. Uh, don't, I forgot how you get it, though. Um, like, we'll get that... We'll get all crystal shards here and then end the video off. Oh, I think you need... I think you might need spark. A needle, I think. I don't know. Like, it gives you spark there. Oh, I didn't work. Do these give you... Ah, oh, it didn't work. Come here. Come here. Nice cutter. Is it like... Is it like needling... A spark and cutter we need? To get this? I don't know. We can see... Whoa! Whoa! Oh, damn it! Hard to dodge them when you need to do something. <laughs> Adeline again. And he's not going to give me anything. Alright. And we just. In fact, let's try. I said, let's try double spark. All right. How about needle and spark? Oh my god! I keep taking damage. All right. No, not like that. Get him, cutter. Then let's try it. What? Are you serious? Really? Really? Okay. Just let me stop touching them, Kirby. I said stop touching them. Oh my god. Alright, there we go. like that. Oh, we need to dive down more. Oh, come on, it can still hurt you from there. I could be wrong, though. Nope. It's not that ability at all. Don't know what you need. I have no idea what you need. Uh, spark and needle? I was thinking of that, but then again, it won't work, will it? No. It doesn't. I don't know, then. I have no idea what you use, then. Uh, I'll just finish it, and then we'll come back later to get it. I'll just look it up and then find out. Oh, come on! Stop touching the enemies! Do you love them or something? What is wrong with you? Oh my god. I, are you serious? Stop getting stuck in them, please. I said... Oh, what are you doing? I know from above there, it's not. there's nothing useful up there anyway, so... Keeps damaging me. Come on. There we go. I think this is the end of the level. Oh, that was such a struggle. Oh, and the bonus cards over there. Wow. Right, so. It's just the last one, so I'll look this up. And then after we got that, after we get that, then we'll end the video off. Okay, guys, I'm back. You need the snowman and bomb ability mixed up. To do this so so the only hard thing is getting past here really but after that you should be fine um, all right so we're gonna go down here avoid these as you possibly can there you go and then right here is where you want to bomb you want to wait there you go and then you go up here and then you get 
your crystal shard. There you go. And that's it. That's all you do here. So now we just got to finish the level and then boom. Do -do -do. Alright, there we go, finish it, and the bonus card's right there now. Oh, still get it though, okay. So yeah, that'll be it for today's video, guys, so next time on Kirby 64 The Crystal Shards, we'll tackle on the rest of uh, Aqua Star and uh, the other worlds, hopefully. Uh, hopefully they'll be easy and not too hard, but I shall see you guys next time. Video game, Jane Poop out. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!